Welcome to this video guys. Let's see how we can create a virtual environment and install required dependencies in that virtual environment in PyCharm. So as you can see, I have this project here which is showing no Python interpreter configured. If you are seeing this, then uh, you can do what I, what I am doing right now. If you're not seeing, seeing this, you will be seeing something like this. So in any case, what you can do is you can just click here and then you can click on interpreter settings. And now what we'll do is we'll click on add interpreter. Okay, and what we'll do is we want to create a virtual environment, right? So we will choose virtual environment environment here and click on new because we will create a new environment. And by default, this will create a .venv folder, sorry, not dot, just .venv folder inside our project directory. And base interpreter is the Python that we have installed in our system, which is this one. Both of these are the same thing here. You can click on any Python version that you want as the base interpreter and just click on OK. And now as you can see, virtual environment is being created. So after this is being created, we will use this for our project. So let's wait. Okay, now it is finished. And as you can see in our Python interpreter, this one is selected, the one that we just created. Just click on apply, click on okay. And the folder will also be shown here inside your project directory. And here your project name will be shown Python 3.12 Django test. This means that this Django test the virtual environment inside this Django test is being used. Before, if you remember, only Python 3.12 was being used. That was the global one. Now, how to install packages in this? So what you can do is come here towards this left navigation drawer, click on terminal. And what we need to do is we need to activate the virtual environment so we can install packages in this first. To do that, just type dot slash. It's forward slash in Windows and it's slash like this in Linux and Mac. So I'm on Windows, so I'll do this and then type venv, then scripts, and then activate. You can hit tab to autocomplete, so I'll just hit tab, and this will autocomplete, hit enter. And as you can see, venv is shown in front of this directory here, so this means that virtual environment is activated. Now we can install required dependencies only in this virtual environment, and that will be accessible only by this project. So I'll install Django here, pip install Django, hit enter, and as you can see, this is being now installed. And once this is installed, we will be able to run this project. So after a while, the package is installed and now we can run our project. So since this is a Django project, I'll just run it like this. If this was any other project, you could just do Python and then the file name. So as you can see, our Django is running and we have now created a virtual environment in our PyCharm. So this is how you can create a virtual environment. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below.